we have to come to terms with the fact that technology is playing a huge role in the future, in our current setup, and women contribute to 50% of our population. So it's really important that women are part of this whole technological future, and uh, it has been challenging, I, uh, I should say that, because the field is still very male-dominated. So right now we have a Digital Woman program in three different cities. It started in Berlin, but then we opened in Munich, and now we have a very successful pilot as well in Copenhagen. Lots of people coming from abroad, but they were lacking a place to learn, to get trained. So this is why we need platforms like Ready School to connect people together. I come from Eritrea. I've been since four years here in Deutschland. I was in einem kleinen Dorf äh, wusste ich keine, zum Beispiel, wie kann man äh, der Laptop anschalten oder ausschalten. Aber jetzt kann ich alles. There's something so rewarding and satisfying with looking at how students progress, how enthusiastic they are to uh, learn about the subject. I'm glad that I can pass on what knowledge I've learned over the years to some more women and hopefully empower them to go and explore and do their own thing. I'm from this favela in Rio de Janeiro and I have all this system say for me, oh, you can do this, you're not for technology, and now I'm here. Viele Frauen hier bei Ready School eine Chance bekommen. Ich habe sechs Jahre mit dem Computerprogramm gearbeitet, aber nach dem Krieg in Syrien gibt es keine Arbeit, gibt es viele Probleme. Und ich suche zurzeit auch ein Praktikum in meinem Bereich, aber in deutscher Sprache. It's not just for me, it's for who comes after me. I need to be inside of this field because I really believe the technology is the key for change. There are 124,000 open positions in IT. So bringing girls in coding, it's, it's definitely a goal for the future.